Hello friends, welcome to the video lecture series of differential equation. In last video, we reduced non-homogeneous differential equation to exact differential equation. Non-homogeneous differential equation to exact differential equation. Now, we are going to reduce non-exact differential equation into exact differential equation. But that non-exact differential equation is of this type. F1 xy y dx plus f2 xy x dy f1 xy is a function of x into y f2 xy is a function of x into y the function of x into y means what like this function of x into y this xy is a function of x into y xy power 2 is a function of x into y x raised to power n y raised to n is a function of x into y here if i write 2 here or constant okay, or 1 so 1 can be can, can be written as x y to the power 0 so this type of functions are the functions of x into y here the differential equation is of this type f1 x y y dx plus f2 x y x dy so that this differential equation or this type of differential equation can be converted into exact differential equation or can be reduced to exact differential equation using this integration integrating for factor for in last uh, video lecture we use formula 1 by mx plus n y here i am using 1 by mx minus n y the 1 by mx plus n y we use for homogeneous differential equation and in homogeneous differential equation each and every terms degree same here, if the equation is of this type, then use integrating factor formula 1 by mx minus n by and this formula may be asked as mcq also, as an mcq also. Now the problem on this type, see this differential equation is given y 1 plus xy dx plus x 1 minus xy dy. See, this is this bracket is a function of x into y. One can be written as xy to the power 0 function of xy. This xy is a function of x into y. Function of xy y dx. And here one is a function of xy. xy is a function of xy no doubt. The f2 xy x dy. Here f1 xy y dx plus f2 xy x dy equal to 0. This equation is of this type. Therefore, integrating factor is what 1 by mx minus ny this formula i am using here we have minus you know? now what is m what is m mx minus ny what is m m is a coefficient of dx means y 1 plus xy this is our m and n is what x1 minus x1 so if you solve it see if you multiply this inside term by xy what will you get xy plus x square y square minus xy into 1 minus minus plus x square y square this is equal to this minus xy and plus xy gets cancelled therefore 1 by 2x square y square is an is integrating factor 1 by 2x square y square is integrating factor this integrating factor may be asked as an mcq this differential equation will be given and you will be asked to find out integrating factor as an mcq now once you get integrating factor once you get integrating factor so multiply this equation by integrating factor multiply equation 1 by integrating factor if you multiply equation 1, one by integrating factor this is m dx n dy is equal to 0 multiplied by integrating factor I am multiplying this by integrating factor 2x square by square here I am writing 2x square y square 
this is as it is y 1 plus x y and x 1 minus x y. So what did I do here? Multiply this by integrating factor. Here in the integrating factor, this 1 by 2 is common, you can cancel this 1 by 2. Or you can keep as it is and you can carry forward, no problem. But if in integrating factor, multiplicative constant is present in the denominator and which is common factor, then you can remove it. Or if you continue it in later stage, it will get cancelled. Now, y by this y by this one, 1 by x square y, 1 plus x y, dx, 1 by x y square, 1 minus x y, dy is equal to 0. Okay, this 1 y gets cancelled, 1 x gets cancelled. Now multiply 1 by this one, 1 by x square y plus x y by x square y is 1 by x and plus 1 by x y square x y by this is minus 1 by y dy. Okay. Now after multiplication, after multiplying this by integrating factor, this equation by integrating factor, so this will be exact differential equation. Now, this is exact differential equation and solution of an exact differential equation, how do you get solution of an exact equation? Integral of m, m of exact differential equation, 1 by x square y plus 1 by x integral of m with respect to x and the terms in n which are free from x. Here in n, you can call this as small n, this is small n. Terms in n which are free from x, this term containing x don't write, this term is free from x that can be written here, minus 1 by y. And this is a solution format, I have to write C here. Now, keep y constant, 1 by y is constant, integral of 1 by x square is minus 1 by x. Then integral of 1 by x is log x, integral of 1 by y is log y with respect to y. And C integration constant you can take. For you, if you want to put log C, you can put log C as integration constant, it is your choice. Okay. If you put as C as an integration constant, it is also minus 1 by xy here log of C minus log of x minus plus log y. In examination, you can keep up to this. Okay, solution you can keep up to this. But in order to guess to get most simplified answer by law of logarithm, C by x due to this minus sign and due to plus sign into y like this. Now c y by x remove log from right hand side it will take this one minus one by x y will be in the index of e. So this is general solution for this differential equation. In examination you can keep up to this of this technique. Now this is the differential equation given now integrating this is m capital m including this y including this s x it is capital n this x you know this x outside of the bracket put value of m put value of n then try to simplify then you will be getting integrating factor 1 by 2 x per y square i have written directly now multiply this equation equation 1 by multiply 1 by integrating factor multiply 1 by integrating factor so what I am going to do 1 by 2 x square y square this is m dx 1 by 2 x square y square this is and dy is equal to 0. Okay. 
What is m? Y x square y square plus x y plus one. Here x x square y square minus x y plus one. M dx plus m dy multiplying this by integrating factor. In integrating factor, two is common, you know. So this I am going to remove. Two. Okay, or you can carry forward two also. Yeah, eventually it will get removed. Then y divided by x square y square. One more step I am going to add here. Uh, x square y will remain. This is as it is. You can write it directly also. I am writing indirectly. I increase one more step. Here x by x square y square is one by x y square. And x square y square minus x y plus one dy equal to zero. Now multiply this all this inside term by one by x square y. What will you get? This x square will disappear. Y square by y is y. X y by this will be what? One multiplied by this is what? Then x square y square by this one is what? X here x y. By x y square, it will be y, and like this. See. Now, after multiplying this equation by integrating factor, I think it is an exact equation, exact differential equation, and no need to check whether it is exact or not in examination. Now solution for this I am writing solution for this differential equation. Okay. So what is the solution? Integral keeping y constant m m is this m the m from exact differential equation. Remember you may call this as small m small m and this is capital M capital M. Okay, it is your choice. So integration of m with respect to x. And terms in and which are free from x. This term containing x don't write. This term is free, free from x. We can write this term containing x don't write. Is equal to c. This solution form. Now integral of y with respect to x is y into x. Y we are keeping a constant. Integration of one by x is log x. Integration of one by x square is what minus one by x and one by y is as it is because we are keeping y constant while integration with respect to x minus log y is equal to c. The integration constant log c you can put and you can collect the log terms in that way you can do. But if you keep this as answer, it is okay. In this way, second problem we solve. Now third one. Third one. Find integrating factor. See the third sum for you. Is it? If you look at this differential equation, very okay. If you look at this differential equation, then here y is common in each and every term. So what I am going to do? Why I am taking common? Why I have taken common? And from the next bracket, I am taking x common. Plus 2. Dy is equal to 0. Now, now, this is function of xy, y dx, plus function of xy, x dy equal to 0. I mean, this is of the type f1, xy, y dx, plus f2xy x dy this equation is of this type use integrating factor formula 1 by mx minus ny this integrating factor I am writing directly because this problem is for you this will be integrating factor and the solution final answer also I am writing if this equation is of this type an integrating factor 1 by mx minus n by put m is equal to this 
n equal to this complete and try to solve this simply integrating factor and if you multiply this equation or this equation by integrating factor you will get exact differential equation and if you solve exact differential equation you will get this solution okay this problem is for you and try to solve this to be stopping thank you very much